paste. We're super fucking punctual. <laughs> and punk. And we have tapes, real tapes. Hey, Steven. How you doing? Great. You know, we're I was live. thinking, hey, but before we were live, we were talking about like paste, like, you know, what's the pa paste catchphrase? What if it was, um, what if it was paste? We have real tape. We should think about that. Because this looks fake. You, it's not fake. And it's actually like a project. Like this looks like, it's like, oh yeah, you know, we'll get a, get a lot of vibe from the, you know, the old tape, but it's actually legit. If you open all the tapes, you'll find tape in the tapes. That's uh, a lot of tape. Yeah. Yeah. It's probably a fire hazard. Well, <laughs> <clears throat> welcome to the Pace Studio with all the tapes. Um, nice to be here. Thank you. Will you tell us about the first song that you're going to play? Well, yeah. Uh, let's see. I was just trying to figure it out because I've never played it. I've never played it before uh, like this. So we've been playing it on the, on, on this little Christmas tour or like, uh, you know, Third Eye Blind's out doing the, the holiday shows, the, the ones where we go and we genuflect to, the, uh, to the, the, the radio stations that play our music. Um, happy to do it. <laughs> um, and uh, we put out after the tour, after after uh, we ended our tour in September. So we put out We Are Drugs, the new EP, and we haven't really toured on it. So we've just been out playing the whole thing. So we've been playing it live, but I've never played it like like uh, like this. Well, it's a judgment free zone. Is it? Yeah. Is it? Is it? Okay. I don't know which camera we're looking at. Uh, shall we? We <clears throat> shall. Uh, yeah, it's called Don't Give In. Um, and by the way, every single song I play these days feels like some kind of fight song. I'm on the side of everyone who wants to stay alive. Let's go for a ride on my motorbike I can't hear a thing, I know what you're saying Don't give in, say it now like a friend Don't give in, I'll tell you one thing that I'm not Don't think that you're right cause you didn't get caught Tell me now where you been Don't give in, don't give in And the thing that's killing me it's a vision of a life I was supposed to be Without each other with nothing but Don't give in Cause when your sunroof top It kicks down I am right by your side It doesn't work for you then Don't do it be yourself again It doesn't work for you then Don't do it, don't live your life ten. This season, if you lose your heart, then you lose your reason. My swatch buckle wearing thin. Don't give in, don't give in. What do you want me to do? Spend my brightness burning for you. Without each other, we're nothing. Don't give in, it doesn't work for you. Be yourself again, it doesn't work for you. Don't give in 
Say it now like a friend. Don't give in. I love you more than anything. Don't give in. Don't give in. Don't give in. Rachel. Rachel. Uh, that was awesome. Thank you. I uh, enjoyed the shout out at the end too. So thank you. Um, so right before we went live, yeah, we were talking, we were exchanging opinions. On, we were chopping it up over chicken soup. We were. Yeah. Well, you had the chicken soup. Um, we were talking about Kanye West's visit to to Donald Trump today. Oh. And the internet's can been we not a flame? Can we just fade that to mute? I think that's the best thing to do. All right. It all just right. shut that whole conversation down yeah yeah between you and me or between kanye and uh and and donald trump the whole that whole that whole meme has got to go i think that we have to stand united in resistance and and we are seeing something we are seeing unprecedented um set up for horribleness and trying to work with this is a really really bad idea yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, I'm not down. Like, you know, I met with Al Gore's people. I met with the, the Climate Reality Project. And they went and met with, with, with uh, Trump. And I said, you, got, you just got duped. You just got played, you know? Wow. Yeah, because they didn't go in and ask for anything. So they just got their photo opt and just got co-opted into a birther who, who denied the legitimacy of the first black president to come in um, with the help of the Russians, so basically the Russians just installed their candidate um, so that he could plug in Exxon, the CEO of Exxon, to be the Secretary of State to make the world safe for more oil production. That means it's fucking curtains. Like, this is a, this is a state of absolute emergency we're in, and, and anybody who goes in and tries to work with Trump is normalizing it. This is not normal and it's not it's it's not safe to normalize it. So played, I says. I says you got played. I agree. Is that enough? That's yeah. Right. Spot on. Well on on that note, do you want to play us your second song? Yeah, I'm all in the mood for another jam. Awesome. Us too. Um let's see. Um mm mm mm. Oh, okay. Yeah. Let's see. Hmm. 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 Trying to think. Oh yeah. I'm trying to like trans like transpose these things to guitar. Um Yeah, this is a song. Um basically I was at one of these wash stands, um, outside of a bathroom like hipster hipster restaurant in the mission in San Francisco and it's like thing where like you know the 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 actual like you know the toilet is like these separate rooms but then you have these communal like wash things you stand there and you you wash wash up together yeah I've seen those yeah and they're like they're like stunningly like intimate and intense <clears throat> that's the song the company of strangers <laughs> It's now on We Are Drugs, now available in vinyl because it was recorded on tape. Uh, okay. At a night time, washed and you're staring me down. You had me so embarrassed. And this restaurant crowd was oh so loud. Your face, I've been crying, you were ravaged by jealousy. You said, Look what love has done to me. We can slip out the back right now if you want to save me. Start to haunt me, I feel that danger. You like holding on to the company of strangers. She said, Promise not to kill me, and maybe I will let you in. Her apartment's cold as a mace can. She said, I just want to get it, I don't need to understand. I said, Show me your face, and she said, I would rather wear a blindfold. Truth be told, I want a robot. Robot heart is all I want If you're the one who knows me best Tell me why 
Why do I feel so, 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 so depressed? I want to live a life of danger I like holding on to the company of strangers I like holding on to the company of strangers I like holding on to the company of strangers In your eyes what you see is what you want me to be So that's what I will be What you want me to be That's what I will be What you want me to be Fuck a fuck away the emptiness until you get caught In the loving arms of a robot A robot heart is all you got If you're the one who knows me best Tell me why Why do I feel so, 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 so second best I wanna live a life of danger I like holding on to the company of strangers I like holding on To the company of strangers I like holding on To the company of strangers It's over! Hey. Our part's over. That's great. Um, so, well, we, we have a really nice comment here uh, from Curtis LeMay. He says, great. Curtis, uh, hold that comment for just one second <laughs> while I go get my soup. <laughs> All right. Stand by. Curtis says you've always been one of his favorite songwriters. Thank you. And uh, on that note... Before we went live, we before were we go talking. into that though, Rachel, can I oh, just no, no, say no, no, it's not political that I'm wearing like the the, <laughs> yeah. the um the drop crotch pants. Uh huh. Yeah. <clears throat> the problem with them is <laughs> there's almost no way that they're not going to catch some soup. So while we talk with Curtis, mm -hmm. I just want you to know what's on my mind. Oh. Well, okay, no, go ahead. No, that's fair. Um, but you know, you also don't need a napkin, I guess. No, not really. Yeah. Yeah. Um, also, our carpet's probably you could just, safe. Yeah. Um, well, I was just going to ask where... just wipe with where, your crotch. <laughs> I was going to ask, where you get the bulk of your song, songwriting done? I mean, I hear that you are pretty much always constantly songwriting, thinking of new ideas. Fairly often. Um, although there's, like, there's also times where you just kind of have to go, like, that's output mode. You kind of have to go into, like, quiet and go into receive mode and, like, read some books and... And um, be the one who's not talking at the dinner party and who's actually listening and and walk around in a state of melancholy and like travel and, and those things and fill, start to fill up your notebooks. And then it starts to turn into music and you start to have that urge. So I go through those phases as well. But um, I was saying earlier, I wrote a song on the, on, on the bus last night. It was not last night. It was two nights ago. And we're out, we're doing these Christmas shows. And, and when we go on like, when we go on longer tours, like if we do like an eight week run, everyone's super into it. We all go running, we go on bike rides, you know. But when it's a two week run like this over Christmas, and we've been touring for a long time, it's really, really bad behavior all around. Like it's bad food. All that bad food is washed down with copious amounts of tequila. <laughs> and um, and then we stay up late. We sleep all day. There's very little washing. Certainly <laughs> not with like things like soap and water. Um, and uh, the other night, we were, we were driving down the road. We're going about 75 miles an hour. We're on, we're, and we're all in one bus. Usually, there's a, a few buses like that's You know, we have... I have my bus, um, but we're all in the same bus. So there's 12 of us on a bus, just, you know, black on black, top to bottom. St and we're all kind of like, we like to be get a, be together. Like our band and our crew, we're kind of like puppies, you know, and uh, like to all be like gathered up together. So we're all up there. It's about four o'clock in the morning. We're all still drinking beer and tequila. Um, we had a new crew member. Her name's Janice. 
hi Janice and Janice we were singing we were making up songs to Janice so we were just writing um, um, we were writing a song about how Janice isn't, wasn't drunk enough yet and she was really liking that song and she was just just kind of yeah um, so we're writing songs to, to our new crew member and then um, we had this game where we were throwing a banana out the front window from the from the front of the um, of the bus and it, when you're going 75 miles an hour if you throw it it will actually stay airborne long enough that you can catch it. Its trajectory is such that you can catch the banana. But at this point, you're hitting that banana at 75 miles an hour. And then the banana explodes in your hand. Have you tried this? <laughs> and this just prompted a song. Yeah. Is. And it's, it's, it's straight up, um, it's, like, it's like devil metal. <laughs> and that's my first foray into it. Um, my manager's super excited because she just loves anthrax. So awesome. Yeah. So it awesome. sounds like it's kind of like an ode to like Dio and and uh, and like uh, uh, Iron Maiden. It's kind of one of those tracks. So I got, like I started writing the song, and as I was singing the song, I was like, I was already designing the T-shirt. <laughs> nothing. Nothing says a uh, mashed fruit like anthrax and other. Uh, classic metal. Yeah. Yeah. But that is, that's not what you're going to play last for us, is it? Oh, am I playing another song? Uh, yeah, if you want mm. to. Mm -hmm. I do. Awesome. <sighs> um, so all the radio stations we played for uh, that we've been going out playing for are all playing uh, Company of Strangers, which makes me feel really good. Like I've never gotten over the kind of the sense of like like giddy joy and and titillation of of hearing my song on the radio. Although if they're old songs, then I don't want to hear them. Um, <clears throat> but I do want you to play them. Um, um, but when I hear a new song, I I, I just go crazy. So uh, or I. I pleased um so uh coming to strangers getting played on the radio and it's great mm. and then but um this song is getting played on the radio in the philippines and it's like number eight in the philippines or something like that um radio in the united states won't touch it that's my second favorite thing is like they want to play it but it's too like it's too much for them. So if I'm not gonna get played on the radio, at least I want to be like I want somebody to be you know. I want it to leave a mark. So this is a song from a true. This is a true story. Um, <clears throat> uh, and it's called "Cop Versus Phone Girl." Shakara showed up to class. She pulled out her mobile phone. It's the one thing that she owns to keep her known. She's an orphan now. She just moved to a foster home. That phone keeps her connected. She gonna keep that shit connected. The teacher said, get out of the class. Come on, can I stay? To his shame, he said, the call's been made. I hear footsteps sound eager of a cop that's about to beat her. Now I am all, I am all for the good fight. And if the cops roll by, throw a peace sign, say, hey baby, have a good night. I am up for the good fight. And if the cops roll by, let the colors go blind, say, hey the kids, hey, hey the kids, hey the kids are alright. Officer Slam came into Shikara backwards against the wall. I mean, he kicked just like a rag doll and broke her arm. Tossed across that room, face down on the deck. Put his hands around a 16-year-old girl's neck Now I am all, I am all for the good fight And if the cops roll by, go with peace sign Say, hey baby, have a good night I am all for the good fight And if the cops roll by, let the colors go blind Say, hey the kids, hey, hey the kids Hey the kids are all There's a little 
of the blood spatter Why is it so hard to say black lives matter Doesn't mean that you're anti-white Take it from me, I'm super fucking white And on the tally Hey that's Nayaya Kelly On the Kelly file Saying the Fox News crew is proud of you She's a girl that stood back to a brutal attack You give a cop from the back, come do a victory lap Hey I fooled you, that never really happened I mean come on, could you imagine? So I take it in my hands I talk about this shit in my rock band And I got black fans And I got fans with suntans And we all have the same demand Say I am all I am all for the good fight And if the cops roll by Throw a peace sign Say hey baby have a good night I am all for the good fight And if the cops roll by Let the colors go blind Say hey the kids Hey the kids All the kids are all right All the kids are all right All the kids are all right So uh, just to close out, will you tell us where you're playing? Um, yeah, I'm playing a couple acoustic shows tonight, um, and they sold out really fast, and I've never done that before um, um, in, in Manhattan. And then um, we're doing um, um, a couple more radio shows. I think tomorrow night we're in like Tulsa, and then we're in Kansas City, and then, uh, and then I'm uh, off to go surfing in Costa Rica, and nice. then restart in the new year. Awesome. Um, thank you so much again for being here. Really Thanks for the soup. It. You Our guys pleasure. are, yeah. Hope we get to see you soon. Yeah, I mean, I've been to a lot of places today. No, nobody brought me soup. Okay, can I can I do like the whole um, um, the paste like the paste thing? Yeah, paste. Whatever you want. We got tape up in this motherfucker. Is that the end? Yeah. This is that awkward moment where we're like, they're still on camera and they catch yeah. all the other stuff.